Hello everyone, welcome to my channel. In this video I will be solving a really nice number systems problem. So we need to find the base of the number system in which the number 651 is written as 10101. So that means uh, number 651 base 10 is equal to 10101 uh, base x and of course we need to find x so how can I do this um, I can write this as 651 is equal to and now by the definition of number system this will be 1 times x to the fourth power plus 0 times x cubed plus 1 times x squared plus 0 times x to the first power that's just x and plus 1 times x to the 0 and that's 1 so 1 times 1 is 1 okay now I will simplify this a little bit so 651 is equal to x to the fourth power plus x squared plus 1 okay now I can move everything to the right side so I have x to the fourth power plus x squared minus 650 is equal to 0 and now I can use a substitution so I will set t is equal to x squared and t must be non-negative number so greater than or equal to 0 and now I have t squared plus t minus 650 is equal to 0 okay so this is of course a quadratic equation so you can solve this uh, with uh, quadratic formula or by factoring so I will show you uh, both ways so with uh, quadratic formula this will be t is equal to minus 1 plus minus square root of 1 plus 4 times 650 divided by 2 so that will be minus 1 plus minus square root of uh, this will be 26 or 1 okay divided by 2 and this will be minus 1 plus minus 51 divided by 2 so we have two solutions minus 1 plus 51 that's 50 divided by 2 that's 25 and the second solution minus 1 minus 51 that's minus 52 divided by 2 that's minus 26 okay but uh, t uh, has to be non-negative number so minus 26 is not a valid solution so 25 is actually only solution okay so we have t is equal to 25 and the second way uh, by factoring um, you can use a fact that 6 
150 is equal to 25 times 26 okay so t squared plus t minus 650 is equal to 0 and now by factoring we can write this as t plus 26 times t minus 25 is equal to 0 okay and we have t1 is negative 26 and t2 is equal to 25 and again negative 26 is not a valid solution so we have only one solution t is equal to 25 so we get the same solution and now uh, we need to find x and not uh, t so uh, t was uh, actually x squared so now i can write x squared is equal to 25 so x is equal to plus minus 5 okay so again i have two solutions but negative 5 is not a valid solution because uh, x cannot be a negative number because uh, number system uh, cannot have a negative base so the only solution to this problem is actually 5 okay and basically that's it for this problem I hope everything was readable and understandable and I hope you enjoyed it uh, of course like this video Comment, share, subscribe to the channel and I will see you in the next one.